The graphics on the can are actually pretty cool. I like it. So let's open this up. This is the zero sugar one. We just got back from the dentist. Well, we're on our way home from the dentist. What was, what's the good news? What's the good news? I'll have to go right now. <sighs> Two cavities. Two cavities in six months, because we just went six months ago. Christmas sugar. And brush your teeth better. It could be Christmas sugar, because you can't develop a cavity in less than a month. All right, so it's not from it's from brushing your teeth not that well or not at all I then. I brush my teeth. She got magic cavities then, apparently. Apparently they're magical cavities. They just appear out of nowhere. You are magical. Go. Oh wait, we already filmed. Good morning. Hi. Oh, I'm making breakfast. I'm making the baby egg and the baby egg pan. Whoa, that was stuck. But it, the water on the bottom made it stick to the stove and I almost launched egg everywhere. Jesus. <laughs> yes. Eggs, breakfast, he's editing, but. Yes, getting things done so I can launch. The Mountain Dew. Come on, thumbnail. Come on, thumbnail. There we go. I haven't been in like an official review in a while. Mountain Dew. What is it called? Let me make sure. I Major go. Melon. Major Melon. Major Melon. It says Mountain Dew charged with watermelon. And it has the graphics on it are actually pretty cool. It has, oh my gosh, with the fuzziness and the. There's like a crazy looking. Oh my gosh, with the. Just, just focus yeah, on the can. Just, oh, there we go. Yeah, yeah, so there's a crazy, wa crazy watermelon down there, like an army hat, and then there's one up there, and then there's... The graphics on the can are actually pretty cool. I like it. So let's open this up. This is the zero sugar one. So it has zero sugar. How many grams of caffeine? Caffeine, caffeine. 68, so it's like a little less than a cup of coffee. <coughs> Lily's like, what are you guys doing? What is that position? <laughs> That's her modeling pose. <laughs> <laughs> you guys can't see Lily, but she looks ridiculous. Okay, all right, this Mountain Dew. It smells good. I can already smell it. It smells. It smells like fruity. Like, <laughs> it smells like Mountain Dew plus watermelon. Pet, yep. <laughs> okay. All right. You want a cup, or you just want to drink it out of the can? I'll just drink. <laughs> Mm. All right, well, I'll wait until you try it so you can give your professional review. review. My professional review. Ooh. Ooh. Sugar-free soda. A lot of people talk crap and think it doesn't taste that good. To me, it doesn't taste bad. Well, it depends on the soda. I would say that one doesn't... It does depend on the soda. Mountain yeah. Dew sugar-free stuff, you it, really can't you tell. You can't taste At all. Like at all. Baja Blast, a Taco Bell sugar-free. It, it's amazing. So this is good. Yeah, that's that's really good. The watermelon isn't overpowering, but you can taste it, and it tastes, it tastes really good. Like, it tastes like you know those, um, like the soda machines at places now, where you can like pick the drink and then you. Pick, oh, like, you can make it any you flavor want. you want. It tastes like like something like that, but it's like it's good. It's really good. I had no idea this uh, this was coming out. We were just... No, it, we would just walk through the store and we saw it and it was literally there. We had no idea when this came out. Yeah. It's good though. It's so good. it's good. I give it a 4.75 out of 5 zombies. I'll definitely get it again if they have it still, but... Mm -hmm. I wonder if they just have like individual bottles of it somewhere. We just saw the cans. We didn't see like... Yeah, they, we got a case a case of these. What do you rate it? What is your rating? Oh, uh, probably 4.75. It's really good for Mountain yeah, Dew. It's good. I've never been unimpressed with the Mountain Dew flavor. Do you want to pour some in your cantaloupe? Why would I pour some in there? Because it's melon and melon. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. That was stupid. All right, anyways, okay. Mountain Dew review. Good stuff. Go try it out. If you can find it. I don't... We, we shopped at Fry's, so that's where yeah. we got it. Fry's, Kroger, Myers, all those stores, the same thing. It's good, though. Got some more cards today. Got some more cards today. Let's get you guys turned around so I can show them to you. Not too many, just a couple. I figured I'd show them to you now so I'm not all backed up. First off, the super nice couple that I've been buying cards from gave me a free card. 
a Japanese. I I love how my camera just kind of auto focuses all the time. It just does it whenever I ask it to. See, it says, here's a bonus card for you. Explanation point. Oh, this isn't, oh gosh. Yeah, okay, yeah, it is a Japanese card. Okay, I thought it was the, uh, the Evolution Secret Rare, but it's actually a vintage. And you can tell because that is an old back. I didn't really look at this card until just now. That is super nice of them. I got, one more le let me pick all these cards up. One more legendary card. Energy. I got a Pikachu, I think in Reshiram. Tag team gold card. Good stuff. This is probably my favorite card that I got today. A Blaine's Charizard Hollow. Nice card. It's in a near mint. It has a teeny bit of whitening on that corner right there, but other than that, it's it's pretty it's pretty pack fresh. And then I got a couple first. Oh no, just one first edition hollow. This is a dark Houndoom. Hound Hound Doom. A Giovanni's Nido King hollow, not first edition. I got a Pikachu. It is a promo card from the Pokemon WB movie. I have another one of these but it's not the pikachu i think it's the mewtwo and then i just got a bunch of first edition cards let me here first edition just first edition first edition raichu this is probably the best first edition that i got today hey what was that dark golduck and a ghastly a full pix and then a, a dark whatchamahoozit ursing Chansey, I can't read these backwards, it's kind of difficult. A Dirachi, Dr a Dratini, and then just another trainer, first edition. And then these last two cards, I I don't know why I got them. I didn't, I barely even paid anything for them. They weren't expensive, it's because they're super common cards, but I guess I like the, how dark they are, so... There's just a couple of common GX cards. I mean, I know common GXs aren't common, but yeah, got those. And last thing, almost forgot, which I'm gonna film in a few minutes. I got the new Battle Academy set. Pokemon, obviously, easy to learn, fun to play. And I got this because there are there are a Charizard, a Mewtwo, and a Raichu card in each. And there's three separate like decks or whatever, but the cards look like, from this picture right here and from what I've seen online, are special to this box. You can't get them anywhere else, so that's why I got it. This thing was super cheap too, so I was surprised. So that's why I got it. I got it mainly for the Charizard card. I mean, let's be real. But I also want the... I mean, I like all three. I like Mewtwo as well, and I like... Um, I like Raichu also. And then it comes with uh, a metal coin, which is cool. Other than that, I mean, it'll be on the uh, ASMR channel. That's what I'm filming this for. But yeah, that's everything I got today. I know, not too much. Nothing crazy. Except for the uh, Blaine's Charizard. And the gold card. Okay, I got a couple of good cards today. Alright, that's all. Night, night. Time for bed. See you guys tomorrow. Sleepy time.